Hi everyone. Today we are going to start chapter number 11, tables and line graph. First write your name, class and date. Page number 101, book 4B. Worksheet 1 is table. Compare the table below. Here you can see three children were here. Reming, Kate and Farhan. The mass and height of each children is given. So we have to make a table, write the name of each child, the mass and the height of each child. Page number 102. Here we have the bar graph shows the numbers of boys and girls in three class. 4A, 4B, 4C. So first, we have to find out that how many boys in class 4A, 4B and 4C. I have drawn a line with the scale so we can easily find out. First, we have to count that the difference between the number is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 4A boys 18 as you can see the line and it's here 15, 16, 17, 18. 4B 10, 21, 22, 23. 23. Here 4A girls 22, 4B girls 25 and 4C girls 10, 11, 12, 13. Now we have to fill the box. First we have to write the class 4A, 4B, 4C. Number of boys 18, 10 and 23. Number of girl 22, 25 and 13. Now we have to write the total number of people in all the classes. 4A, 18 plus 22, 40. 4B, 10 plus 25, 35. 4C, 23 plus 13, 36. Page number 13. On page number 103, here we have the question, a teacher record the test score of all people in class 4C. Test score, number of people. Here are the test score and here are the number of people. So we have to make a table graph here. Now we have to use the information given to complete the table. These lines, 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. This is called 5. So here we have the students who score below 60 and below 60 are 6 5 and 6 between 70 and 71 5 71 and 80 6 81 and 90 3 more than 90 4 number b grade a score more than 80 so grade A score more than 80 number of people means how many of the students will get grade A more than 80 we have 3 grade B score between 70 and 81 between 70 and 81 6 grade C is score less than 71 less than 71 means from these these two sides 6 and 5 means 11 page number 104 here we have the question, the table shows the prices of different masses of rice sold in a supermarket. Here are the bags, here are the masks and here are the price. Use the table to answer the following question. Number one is, what is the price of six small bags of rice? So first we have to find out the small bag. 3 kg of small bag price is 6.25. So we are going to multiply 6.25 with 6. The answer is 37.50. Number B, what is the price of 3 large bag of rice? So large bag of rice, 19.50 multiply by 3. And we get the answer. Number C, Mrs. Lim wants to buy 15 kg of rice. Which bags of rice should she buy in order to spend the least money? Okay, now she wants to buy 15 kg of rice. So it means she can easily buy one large because one large contain 10 kg and one medium one medium contain 5 kg bags of rice and the amount of these are 80 29 but here we have all we have to write only the bags not the amount page number 105 on page number 105 we have to 
find a survey was conducted among 100 people to find out how they travel to school every day the table shows the result of the survey here is the survey walk bus train car and total so boys and girls now we have to write this okay here we have some question mark in the boxes now how many boys travel to school by bus we have to find out that how many boys were travel school by bus how we are going to find this we simply have to we simply have to add the boys 20 15 and 3 they were question mark so we are going to count only walk train and car 25 and 3 when we add these numbers we get the answer 28 Now we are going to subtract this twenty-eight with the total number of boys, and when we subtract twenty-eight with thirty-nine, the answer is eleven. It means that eleven boys were traveling from bus. The number of girls who travel to school by train was three times as many as the number of boys who travels to school by train. Okay, so the number of girls who travel school by train. are three times more than boys who travel by train it means we simply have to multiply this 5 with 3 5 is a 15 it means that how many girls travels to school by train 15 girls how many girls took part in the survey now we have to count the total number of girls and then write the survey here so 15 plus 23 plus 15 Plus eight. So when we add fifteen and fifteen, thirty, thirty plus twenty-three, fifty-three, fifty-three plus eight, sixty-one. It means that sixty-one girls took part in the survey. Number D. How many people walk to school altogether? So what we have to do, we have to add the students. Walk by school. Twenty plus fifteen is thirty-five. Page number one hundred six. On page number one hundred six, we have the question. The medal table shows the numbers of medals won by the top by the top four teams who participate in the national youth sport events. Here are the medals names and the types of medals and total. So first is Team Alpha won dash bronze bronze medal. Team Alpha bronze medal, seventeen. The total number of medals won by Team Bravo is Team Bravo. Here we don't have the total. It means we have to add these numbers and write here. So let's add twenty, sixteen, and twelve. Twenty, sixteen, and twelve. Zero, six, and two, eight. Two, three, four, forty-eight. So the total number of Team Bravo is forty-eight. Team Dash won the most medal. Team, whose team won the most? Fifty-two. Charlie's team. Team Dash won the fewest gold medal. Which team won the won the fewest gold medal? Team Delta. Team Dash won three fewer silver medal than Team Delta. Three fewer silver medal than Team Delta is Team Bravo. Team Delta won twenty-three and Team Bravo won three less. It means twenty. Page number one hundred seven. On page number seven, we have worksheet number two: name, class, and date. Line graph. The line graph shows the numbers of toppers. Trophies won by a school from 2002 to 2006. Here is the line graph. This is called the line graph. The lines. Now we have to fill in the table. Complete the table based on the information shown above. 2002 number of trophies. So here we have 2002 and the number of trophies in 2002 is 50. 2003 here we have 2003. The number of trophies 30. 2004. Here we have two thousand four. The number of trophies. The number of trophies in two thousand four is forty. Two thousand five. Number of trophies 
ट्वेंटी टू थाउजेंड सिक्स नंबर ऑफ ट्रॉफीज थर्टी फाइव पेज नंबर वन हंड्रेड एट Apple sold. Here is a graph in which the line graph shows the numbers of apples sold by a fruit seller in a week. Here is the line graph. So we have to write the answers. On which day was the most numbers of apples sold? It means the top day, and this day is Sunday. On which day was the least number of apples sold? This and this is Thursday. On which day were the same numbers of apples sold? Monday, Tuesday. and friday what is the difference between the number of apples sold on wednesday and saturday on wednesday the apples sold 400 and on saturday the apples sold 500 so the difference between 400 and 500 is only 100 page number 109 The line graph shows the numbers of shirts produced by a tailor every year from 2010 to 2013. Here is the line graph. Find the increase in numbers of shirts produced 2010 to 2011, 2010 to 2011, in 2010 100 and in 2011 300. So the number increases to 100 and 200. 2011 to 2012, 11 to 12, only 100. And from two thousand twelve to two thousand thirteen, the number increased three hundred. Between which two, which one year period was the greatest increase in the numbers of shirts produced? Two thousand twelve and thirteen. The numbers of shirts produced by the tailor dash over the four year. It's increase or decrease? It's increase because from two thousand ten to two thousand thirteen, it will go from hundred to seven hundred. So it means it. increase page number 110 here we have the table shows the numbers of cars entering a car park every hour from 4 pm to 8 pm one day now here we have to draw the graph so first we have to find out the time here here we have the time and here we have the numbers of car number 1 is 4 pm and the numbers of car is 35 so 4 pm here we have the 4 pm and the numbers of car is 35 now here we have 5 pm the numbers of car is 16 60 again here we have the 6 pm number of car is 110 6 and the number is 110 make sure that you have to make the same sizes of the box with the same line so it will easily make the line graph on 7 we have 85 here is 7 and here we have 85 between 90 and 80 here we can have the 85 20 at 8 here is the 20 now we are going to mark the lines together with the help of scale so this is a line graph of number of cars page number 111 on page number 111 we had a mind work out write the date name of people in each of each of the four co curriculum activity cca groups is shown in the table which bar group graph match the information given in the table So here is a table. Tennis is twenty-five. First, we have to find out that which bar graph is matching with the table. To find this, first we have to mark the numbers here. So the numbers I have written here is five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, and thirty-five. So graph A. Tennis is Twenty-five. It's okay. Soccer is twenty-nine. It's correct. Chair is twenty-seven. It's not twenty-seven. It's of less than twenty. So it's not correct. Let's check the other one. Again, write the numbers: five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five. Number eight tennis is twenty five. 
correct soccer is 29 and here we have it's not 29 it's less than 29 so it means it's not correct now here we have 10 is 25 soccer 29 chair 27 bands 19 so it's correct graph C let's check the graph D as well 10 is it's more than 25 so it means it's not correct so graph C match the table same page number 112 here we have the review of the chapter write the name class and date in 2020, 2014 a survey was conducted with 200 kindergarten children to find out what they want to become when they grow up the same group of children were survived survey against a year later the table shows the result of the surveys over the two years so here are the survey and here we have to write the answer in 2014 how many children want to be a singer 50 in 2014 how many more children wants to be teacher than the engineer 2014 teacher and engineer 60 minus 20 is 40 Dash more child wants to become engineer in 2015 than 2014. 55 and 20. So when we subtract 55 with 20, the answer is 35. Dash fewer children want to be teacher in 2015 than 2014. 40 and 60. 60 minus 40 is 20. Page number 113. Again, we have to look at the graph and write the answers. What was the environment of the school in 2012? What was the enrollment of the school in 2012? The enrollment in 2012 is 800. The enrollment increased by dash 2013 to 2014. 2013, 2014, the enrollment increased 100. The greater increase in the enrollment in the period of the time was 2011 to 2012. What do you notice about the school enrollment over the years? I have noticed that the school enrollment increases in every year. It increases. So here is the complete explanation of your chapter.